<laughs> like too cool. Like she she was like the good girl, straight A's, soccer player. I wrestled, I got in trouble a lot. Over time it just kind of snuck up on me. It was like senior year, so it started around, I guess, like Valentine's Day. And then um, so he graduated and then I moved out to California like right away. And then he was gonna go or he like left to join the army, but before that he randomly like drove out to California to come see me. consider myself a successful person in the military field, but I definitely wouldn't have as much success if it wasn't for her support the whole time. Even when I acted like I didn't need it sometimes or it was unwanted. Today's finally the day when I first met you eight years ago. I never would have thought we'd be getting married. But four years ago, you shared with me a side of you never imagined. There was something different about you, and I couldn't help but fall in love with it. These years apart was one of the hardest things I've ever had to do, but it was worth it. I no longer have to say goodbye to you at the airport. Instead, I get to kiss you goodnight. I get to create memories and travel the world with my best friend and our babies, Alpha and Bruce. But mostly, I get to be loved by you for the rest of my life. I can't wait to marry you today and share this life with you forever. Love you always. Have a Gavin, with this ring, I give you my promise that from this day forward, I will give you all my love and snuggles, and you will never feel alone. I vow to love and support you, even with your crazy decisions. I vow to love you even when you come home from work with stinky feet, <laughs> and you don't hang up your towel after you take a shower. I vow to always get Chipotle with you. But most importantly, I vow to be the best mother I can be, to help and Bruce, <laughs> be the best wife I can be, and to never stop being your best friend, your place of comfort, and the love of your life. As this ring has no end or beginning, so shall my love for you. Thank you. 
I didn't think it'd fit, so. Abigail, I vow to be your family in distance and in closeness, in sorrow and in triumph. I will build this life with you. I vow to be a better roommate. I'll hang up my towels. <laughs> and do... And do, and do more dishes. <laughs> You're the person I want to dive head first into life with. When I go out on the weekends, it is you I want to be shutting down the club with. <laughs> when I plan an adventure, it is you I want holding the map. When I speculate about the future, I want to see you in every outlandish fantasy I plan for myself. You're the person I want to rant excitedly to over happy hour drinks. <laughs> You're the person I want to dance around the house with while wearing just my underwear. I don't want to settle down with you. I want to take off with you to faraway countries, foreign landscapes, gems, and corners of the world that would only have looked half as amazing without you by my side. When I strap on a backpack and head to the airport, I want you to be boarding the plane with me. You're the person I want to get lost with, set up camp with, and stumble through dark streets at 5 a.m. after a long, rambunctious night in a city that we can't pronounce the name of. <laughs> <laughs> and last, I vow to tolerate your icy toes. <laughs> but now, we have gifts to tear open. Champagne to chug and a world one night to embark on. It rained on Tuesday, and I thought of you. The sun shining on the Thursday, I thought about you then too. It don't matter when, don't matter why. Every day and night, baby, all the time. You're in my heart, you're on my mind. Simple as that, you are.